today I'll be showing you exactly how to get to Paradise Falls, the teepee, and the Indian Cave in Thousand Oaks, California. You're going to start off by typing Paradise Falls Parking in Thousand Oaks, California. Once you get there, you'll see that there are several trails. I'll be taking the trail on the south part of the parking lot, right next to the public access road. There is no parking fee or permit required, however, park gates are closed at 9 p.m. That's the public access road and we'll be taking the steps down next to it. At the bottom of the steps, you'll make a right for Paradise Falls. After hiking for about half a mile, you'll come to your first crossing. You can either take the trail down or take the steps up. I like taking the steps just because the trail is more leveled and scenic, but both trails will take you to the teepee, which is our next destination. And just so you know where it is in the map, we're taking this trail to the teepee. After you cross, if you look to your left, you'll see the teepee that we're headed to. you'll see the sign for the TP straight ahead. Once you reach this point, it's pretty much the home stretch to the waterfall. In front of the teepee, there is a sign directing you to make a right to Paradise Falls. When the trail starts to bend, look for the sign on the left. To the right side of the waterfall, when you initially go down the main steps, you'll cross the stream using the stepping stones. After you're done enjoying the waterfall, you can go back to the parking lot using the same trail you got here, or you can enjoy the other trails the park has to offer, or you can join us for a final stop to the Indian Cave. You're gonna go up the steps you came from and make a right. And from that trail, you can look down and see the stream that leads to the waterfall. You'll come to a split. If you go up, you'll be going back to the TP. So just continue straight for the Indian cave. And this is where that split is. You'll come to a second split where you'll see a bridge. And I actually didn't take the bridge at all during my hike. Just continue straight and you'll see the sign for the Indian cave.
After you're done exploring the Indian cave, you can take the short but steep trail behind the cave, then make a right to the parking area. Or you can come back down the Indian cave trail, make a slight ride, and you'll run into the steps we went up earlier, and you'll just go down where we came up from. And that is all I have for you today. So if you found value in this video, be sure to give it a like. But more importantly, if you want to see more of this type of content, be sure to subscribe to my channel and add us on Instagram at a hiker on a trail. Also, be sure to click on the description for additional information about this hike.